in New York in March of 2018. And uh, one of the artists on the lineup was Black Sam. Maybe y'all familiar with like him and some of our work that we've done together, but he has a really solid presence in the underground, both uh, being from here, here in LA, as well as, you know, globally, worldwide and everything like that. And um, I, di I didn't know him, who he was or anything at the time. The music resonated with me. I, I, I could hear it, it was like really gritty. It wasn't very commercial, and I hear something like that. It's like the true expression of your soul, as opposed to like something that's. It's kind of like what we talked to, talked about in one of the previous episodes. It's like what you look like regularly, you know, instead of like all of this uh, processed stuff, you know, just like processed foods, you know, like like processed people, you know, <laughs> anything, you know what I'm saying? You know, so uh, I, I met Levi through Black Sand's dad. And uh, Levi and Black Sand's dad go way back, and Levi's engineered some work for, for Black Sand and some of the homies and everything like that. So he is very familiar with the sound uh, that I'm going for, in addition to like having his own background. It can be a fine line when you're trying to find somebody who does both like rap and metal, or like an edgy, you know, that overlap, you know. But uh, Levi's execution on it is perfect. You know, uh, one thing that I like about Levi is, you know, he sees that I'm a diamond in the rough. You know, I'm not like a completed, uh, I'm a work in progress, right? And he sees the potential in not only what I am today, but what I have potential in being. So like, I might be working on like some mad experimental projects and things like that. You know, maybe people, you know, might not be able to hear it, you know, what I'm, what I'm going for, right? But he'll hear, what I'm going for. And that's really valuable in any endeavor or facet of life, you know? So you gotta, you gotta have that foresight in, in whatever you're doing, you know? You don't just do it for today, but you do it for tomorrow and years to come. And like, I feel like that's how you make like classic. <laughs> and how to make something hit, but the creative mind to put that together, no matter if it's put together sloppily or whatever, that's the hard part for anyone to know what to do. All the other shit, you can, you can figure out how to, how, to, how to make those thoughts hit better, but it's having the thoughts to begin with it, right. the, the shit. And hell, that's the present. So don't be so hard on yourself at all. Nah, I'll just show you the best way, you know? The best way. <laughs> <laughs> It's the best. <laughs> but wait, there's more. There's more, yeah. and I'm not sure if you're gonna so, feel the same way. Shit, we started off on a good foot, you know. What I'm saying right, I, I can't right. show you the trash now. Right. <laughs> you want? Do you want to really excel at this? Yeah, I think so. You do? Yeah. yeah. If you really want to, man. Because I be I be tired of rapping sometimes. Like, well, if hey, if you really want to, then yeah. I'll get you on it. That's about it. Like yeah. straight up. I want to like sell beats and shit too. Yeah. 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 Yeah! 